Welcome to the demonstration as to how to use Council for video conferencing with your clients. Council is an online platform. It's a practice management platform. It has a lot of capabilities and it's very easy for clients to use, as you'll see, because I'll do a demonstration. Not only can you have video conferencing sessions with clients on Council, you could also have chat sessions and email sessions. The email sessions is really secure messaging uh, because all of the messages stay on Council's server and it's secure. And Council, of course, provides you the business associate agreement that you would need in order to be HIPAA compliant while using Council as a covered entity. So let me show you counsel, show you what it looks like uh, from the clinician's point of view and the client's point of view, show you how easy it is to use. And counsel, by the way, right now, I think is about $50 a month, uh, which includes all the features. So let me show that uh, to you so you can see what it actually looks like. All right, so here is counsel. This is the main page. Uh, this is what you would see when you first uh, go to Council's website. And as a clinician, you would sign in right here on their main page. So I'm going to sign in as a clinician. Here we go. And this is the main page for a clinician. You can see these really easy to use tabs up at the top. Uh, you, uh, Council actually provides a website for you that you can customize. You can make it look however it is that you'd like it to look. And I'll show you an example of that. This mail tab is secure messaging to email back and forth with your clients. You could have multiple users on this system, such as a biller, a supervisor, um, an administrator. Uh, you do all of your scheduling, your billing, it'll automatically bill insurance for you. Um, and let me show you what it looks like to actually have a video conferencing session, because that's what we're focusing on for this demonstration. I'm not going to go over how to use a practice management program in totality. I'm simply focusing on the video conferencing portion uh, for this demonstration. So to do that, what you do is go to calendar. This is one way to schedule an appointment. There's several. Uh, you would select the day and the time and the format, private session. You could also have a group format. You would choose the client, the type of session, which this one is going to be a video session, the length of, of time of the session. And then you want to put in the time of the session. Let's see here. And then it'll auto fill the uh, CPT code and the rate for this one. I won't charge anything and we'll save the appointment. Okay, so it's that easy. And now you see down here, it says start video session. So all you do is click start video session. And the first thing that it does is it checks the bandwidth for the downstream and the upstream to make sure that it's adequate uh, for this system. And you press continue. And now it's going to ask you, do you want it to allow do you want your computer to allow this system to use your microphone and your camera? You click allow, and then you pop up on the screen, right? That easy. And then the client is going to do the same thing, and they're going to pop up on the screen also. And on this screen, you could chat with them in this chat box, and it will save the chat for you. You could, you could create notes, internal notes and patient notes. Um, you could hide these. You could adjust the volumes and the microphone and so forth uh, makes it very easy to use. With one click of the button, there was nothing to download. That easy. 
So now what I want to do is I want to show you what it looks like from the client's point of view. Okay, so this is what it looks like to the client. This is the client portal. Remember when I said council will create a website for you? This is what it would look like. And you could put as much information on this main page as you would like uh, for your um, prospective clients to see. You know, this is what would be on your website. So the client would simply log in using their own credentials. And now they are logged in and the first thing they see is their appointment, their video conferencing appointment. They simply click on their appointment. They could test their connection, which is really good. So they could get prepared ahead of time before the session begins. And then they could just click start video session. The same thing's going to happen on their end. It's going to test the bandwidth. And then it's going to ask, do you want to allow for your camera and your um, audio? And you click allow. And so there we are. Let's see here. I'm going to hide the chat. So the clinician is on the big screen, right? And the client is here in this little box. So here we are having a video conferencing session, one click of the button on a client portal. It makes it very, very easy to use. And they could change their settings. They could chat back and forth. They could go back to their own client portal over here on this screen. And they could um, use their journal, use their own internal notes. They could fill out um, documentation for the clinician. So that's how that works. Excellent. So that is how you use Council. Um, again, it's a uh, it's a full practice management program, easy to use. It's convenient, has a lot of capabilities. Um, I've been using it for quite a while, and I hope this was helpful for you as a demonstration to show you how easy this works. Uh, if you found it helpful, remember, please like us on Google Plus page or Facebook, and please share this information with other practitioners. And I hope you enjoy all the other videos. Thank you. Bye-bye for now.